Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today, I'm filming a what in a la la la. <laughs> I'm so tired. I'm filming a what I eat in a day. But I think I'm gonna film it today, tomorrow, and the next day because I don't like doing just one day because I feel like that's not really an accurate representation and when I show the course of three days then I can give you guys like options of different meals I make and stuff I don't know more is better okay so today it's like 10 a.m. right now I went to bed at 10 p.m. last night and woke up at 9 30 and I feel like I've literally been reborn I don't know where my phone is but it's Tuesday the day after Labor Day and yeah I'm gonna show you guys what I make I need to make my coffee first things first so let's go do that good morning vlog so I'm going to make breakfast I'm using these like Trader Joe's hash browns these are really good they taste like McDonald's hash browns probably not really good for you but it tastes good and I'm gonna have watermelon too kind of random but it's just kind of what it felt like and then for my coffee I just take these Irving Farm coffee beans grind them up in here and then put them in the French press and then I take my Oatly and I'll just you guys can watch Ugh, And then I just press this button to froth it and then I also do a little bit of this at the bottom of my coffee because it tastes really good but these are similar if you guys don't like like the whole process of making coffee I buy these for on the go and they're delicious so that's my latte that i make super foamy and yummy and then sorry the laundry is so loud <laughs> Here's my hash browns. I'm gonna have my watermelon. And then I also am gonna have a, have a large glass of water in the morning because I don't know if I'm like, this is what you're supposed to include in a what you eat in a day video, but um, I have these vitamins every morning and they're just the Vital Proteins Beauty Boost. These ones detox and de bloat. And then Feeling Zen. Honestly, I don't really know what they do or if they do anything, but I got them sent to me. So I just take them every day because apparently it was supposed to help me. <laughs> but I'm going to eat my breakfast right now and answer some emails. Hello guys, so it is 3.40 and I haven't had lunch yet. I've had like a busy day, kind of a weird day. Um, so I feel like it's kind of not the best rep representation of meals because I'm just like making really quick and easy things but that's why I'm doing this over the course of three days because that's more accurate but right now I'm snacking on some petite carrots keyword petite it's like the only carrots I like because they're like I don't know cute and little but I'm having that with this lemon rosemary hummus. I've never tried this before. I just saw it at the store the other day and it looks good. And then I need to make a quick lunch because I'm meeting up with Ruby in a little and um, I need to go run some errands before my class at 6.20. It's 3.40 right now with this will focus. But yeah, so I'm just gonna make this vegan Amy's burrito, you literally like microwave it for two minutes and that's gonna be my lunch. <laughs> okay, this is the finished product. I think this is just like a bean and rice burrito and then I put lemon on it and this is like the Trader Joe's taco sauce and then my carrots 
my hummus, <laughs> and my watermelon wonder. I feel like this is a very college-esque meal. <laughs> Hi vlog, so I am, I keep saying vlog, this isn't even a vlog. We're doing a what I eat in a day, but I just finished class, I'm really tired, it's almost 9.30. Um, and I don't know why I'm cooking this late, but whatever. Um, also I wanted to make a healthy meal, so like I'm putting effort into this meal right now, so yeah. I don't know, but if you guys make one thing, you guys should make this because I swear to God I eat this like three times a week. It's not that hard, it's healthy, nutritious, and it's really good. So tonight on the menu, we have chickpeas with bell peppers. We're gonna make some kale, broccoli, and then I'm using this like rice from Trader Joe's that you just microwave. But first things first, we need, sorry for the noise, we need olive oil. And we're gonna spray this on here, like so. And then we're gonna get our Trader Joe's chili lime. Oh fuck, I'm smelling this everywhere. Anyhow. <laughs> um, this goes on the chin. Yeah, chickpeas. We're just gonna sprinkle that. I like really spicy, so you don't have to do that much if you make this. Then we're taking the vegan chickenless seasoning. And this is just gonna go over it all because it's really good. Next, rosemary. I put rosemary on everything I make. This is really hard to do with one hand. And lastly, chili flakes. And then we're just gonna turn this on. <laughs> and let them cook. And then while this is like cooking, I kind of just like leave it in here for like, I'd say like eight minutes it takes. 10 minutes, 12 minutes, I don't know, we'll see. It's 9.20 right now, but then while that's cooking i take my kale and drizzle some olive oil on it half a lemon on the kale am i even showing this <laughs> and then half a lemon on this And that's what we're gonna do right now. And I'll update you in a few minutes when I'm gonna, oh, by the way, you have to massage the kale before you put it in here. That makes a big difference. So I'm gonna massage the kale. You guys will just see. <laughs> okay, next step. This has been cooking for four minutes. So I'm gonna cook the rice. Okay, how do I do this? Cook time, four minutes. Um, I'm gonna cook the rice for four minutes and throw the kale in now. And kale shrinks like half the size when you cook it. So it looks like a lot, but it won't look like a lot in a second. And then, once the rice is done, I'm gonna cook my broccoli, which I just steam in like a plastic bag in the microwave for three minutes. And then I top that with vegan butter. And then I'll show you guys the finished product. Okay, it's not the prettiest thing, but this is the final product. I just have broccoli with butter before that looks like really plain and gross but i swear it tastes good and it's an easy way to get your vegetables <laughs> and then chickpeas bell pepper avocado kale and taco sauce on top and then brown brown rice at the bottom and it makes two so i get to have this for lunch tomorrow but yeah if you guys try this let me know because it's really good good morning guys we're making breakfast. <laughs> Ava's unboxing her side table, so we can have that as um, entertainment. I'm gonna balance you on this ah. avocado. 
looks like fruit bowl. It's a really bad angle, but we're just gonna work with it. I'm making just like a fruit plate for breakfast because I have kind of a lot of fruit that I need to eat before it goes bad. So that's what we're doing. Also, I like fruit. Sorry. <laughs> These, I got donut peaches because I saw them and I was like, those look cool. And apparently they're like sweeter than the average peach. But I had one the other day and I was not a fan. But maybe it's just because they weren't ripe. We're gonna try it again this morning. Oh wait, it looks better than it looked the other day. The other day was like stringy on the inside. This is she. You guys all know what fruit tastes like, I hope. But I'm gonna try the donut peach right now to see if they're good. I don't know how I feel about it. It's better than when we tried it the other day. I think I like normal peaches better. That's not, I don't know, something funky about donut peaches. <laughs> Hi vlog. I keep saying vlog because I'm used to vlogging. This is like, I guess not really a vlog. to what I eat in a day or three. But I'm just having leftovers for lunch right now and I added another little like small avocado. Okay, let me set you here. And then I'm gonna put the taco sauce on it because, yeah. But it's like three o'clock right now. It's kind of a late lunch. Because I was um, posting my new vlog, but it got copyrighted, and I like posted a an corresponding Instagram with it to like let people know that I post a new vlog, but the vlog's actually blocked from visibility, which like I thought it was just like blocked from being monetized, which I don't really care about, and so I just like posted it because I was like, whatever, I just want the people to see it, and. For some reason, they can't even see it because I used a stupid Lord remix, which is honestly a really good song. Just wish it would let me use it. <laughs> but um, I'm trying to like edit it out on the YouTube site right now because it was like, oh, you can just trim this part out and then people will be able to see it. So I'm doing that, but it's been like 20 minutes and it's like not uploading still. So I don't really know what to do. And everyone on my Instagram thinks I have a new vlog up, but it's not posting at all. And I'm really sorry, guys. I don't know how I'm not tech savvy. But hopefully, this shouldn't take too long. It's already been like 20 minutes and it just says, being processed, please check back later, please check back later. But it's like, dude, how much later are you gonna make me wait? <laughs> I think I'm, I don't know what's going on with me right now. I'm tired. YouTube question. I um my video got copyrighted. Oh really? Yeah. Which like I didn't care about because I I just thought like it wouldn't get monetized so like whatever. But um it's like being blocked from even like posting and so like have you ever edited on like the YouTube website? It it usually just it probably takes like I don't know maybe an hour but it'll work. Okay. Okay, that's yeah. good. I didn't know if it like was glitching or like I just needed to repost it but if it works then I'll just leave it okay that was good I checked with Ruby and she said YouTube will fix it YouTube just she takes her time we'll say that I'm gonna have another kombucha with my lunch I need to buy more of these because I really like them um this is Watermelon Wonder. I like this brand the best. And if you guys don't know this brand, I recommend watching Cody Ko's video, Kombucha King. And then let me know your thoughts on it because it's seriously the funniest thing I've ever seen in my life. 
but this is my lunch. I'm basically already done with this, but I'll talk to you guys at dinner time. I have a class till like nine o'clock again tonight, so probably another late dinner. Hi guys, so I am just now making dinner. It is 9.40. Um, I'm so tired because I've been up since 7 a.m. and now I'm just now eating dinner. But I had a class until nine o'clock and then I showered and did my nighttime routine. Um, and I was gonna make a really extravagant dinner with like all my new Trader Joe's stuff. I got like the jicama wraps. I was gonna use jackfruit and make like vegan tacos. But I'm just way too tired for that. So hopefully in another video or tomorrow. But I'm just making a simple dinner. Just pasta, rigatoni with, um, I think I'm just gonna make like toast or garlic bread, um, broccoli because vegetables. And I'm using vodka sauce, parmesan, garlic, basil red chili pepper because that's how you get spicy pink sauce <laughs> and then um some butter for the toast but i'll show you guys it when it's all complete okay so here's the finished product looks fire and i'll taste test but i already know what it's gonna taste like chef's kiss 10 out of 10. At the store the other day and saw these, which I used to eat as a child, and they looked good. So I'm gonna have one of these for dessert. Good morning, guys. It's not that early. It is 11.30 a.m. right now. And I woke up at like, I woke up at like 9.20 but did not get out of bed for like a while because um i don't know i just haven't really been sleeping that well and or like i have and then i when i don't it really just like messes up everything so just kind of feeling like bleh <laughs> but this is my mess of a breakfast i have going on right now because i felt like a good breakfast will cure how i feel right now so i just mashed up half an avocado with half a lemon and i'm gonna season it with these three things and then a banana some pineapple um sourdough bread i just put one slice in the toaster and you do that and then i'm making my coffee i already showed you guys this but i can show you guys again so i just use a french press and I know you're supposed to go slowly, but honestly, I get pretty impatient and just go fast. And then, I need to froth my oat milk. So I just put this in here. I really like this frother. My friend Katia got me this last year for my birthday, and honestly, it's like the best thing I've ever gotten. So I put a little bit of this coconut and almond vanilla creamer at the bottom, about that much. Pour in my coffee. And then we're gonna leave some room for the foam. And then I'm gonna have a vitamin C packet right now because like I said, I haven't been sleeping that well and I don't wanna get sick. Ooh. I don't like the smell of that at all. I don't think I'm going to be able to drink that. Why does that smell so bad? I think I have about metal straws, so I'm going to use one of these. It tastes like lemonade. I don't know why I was so scared of that. So, I'm so sorry for like all of the noises that come from our laundry machine. But we have my latte, I have a water, my vitamins that I showed you guys. It's dishes. My breakfast. 
And then lastly, my vitamin C drink. So this is breakfast, guys. Day three. <laughs> what is that? I don't know. <laughs> meal <laughs> do you have this every single day and <laughs> she's lactose intolerant <laughs> and she's always eating cheese anyway this cheese is just really really good what is it i don't know i'm making lunch right now and i'm kind of gonna experiment with a new you recipe you exposed me yeah i did um I bought these Trader Joe's jicama wraps because everyone raves about them. Are you supposed Are you supposed to cook these? Why are they so moist? Ooh, I don't know how I feel about that. We may not be making these. I think they may have gone bad. What's the date today? Depends. Yeah, these expired August 31st. Oh my god. <laughs> Wait, didn't you just buy them? I feel like I did. <laughs> We're not gonna make jicama wraps, guys. I don't even think that's how you say it. Um, yes it is. Jicama? I'm gonna figure out something else to make, I'll let you know. Okay, we're making a new recipe now. What time is it? 3.30. 3.30, so it's kind of a late lunch. But, we're making the vegan chicken that I showed you guys. I've never tried it before, so hopefully it's good. <laughs> and then kale, which I massage with olive oil, half a lemon. And then I think I'm gonna add avocado like just on top. Some rice. We're going to like a bowl. And then the spicy taco sauce. But that's all. I normally, when I cook at home, I eat vegan most of the time because I force myself to buy all vegan groceries. Um, I think the only vegan thing I don't buy is pink sauce or vodka sauce because I'm obsessed with that and it's really good but don't you have vegan pink sauce I need to start buying that so yeah. then I'm like fully eating vegan at home but when I'm out I'll sometimes cheat with like cheese and stuff like if I'm out and I'm hungry and I want pizza like I'll cheat but at home I try to eat all vegan because that's just better for you but we're gonna massage the kale <laughs> I've been eating these because they're really good and I'm hungry. Okay, this is the finished meal with rice, bell peppers, kale, chicken, and avocado. And I'm kind of scared to try the chicken, but we'll see. Yeah, like if you want to try my bowl. Yeah. Will you give a review for the video? Yeah. But okay, make it we have this it's really good. It smells really good too. The chicken scared me, but it's good. That sounded like a commercial. Lucy's on YouTube. You should. No, you shouldn't. Hi guys. So it is the final meal of this video and i feel like i've looked like shit this entire time in this video because i've been cooking all my meals in my apartment and when i'm in my apartment i'm in pajamas and no makeup so um i'm happy i'm ending it on a good note but i figured for the last meal i'll show you guys like a restaurant type thing instead of um, like a recipe because i've been cooking for all of these but my sister and i are gonna go to dinner right now at this like new pop-up vegan restaurant that is somehow connected to Ladybird. if you guys have heard of that 
um but yeah i'm really excited to try it's all vegan i think it's vegan pasta but i really have no clue so yeah i just got ready i know this isn't a vlog but i still feel like you guys may ask me where some of my fits are from so this outfit is from nasty gal and it's like this two-tone jeans and jacket set but i'm running super late right now so time to go to dinner <laughs> Hi guys, so the vegan restaurant we wanted to go to was, oh my god, she has the Kim Possible ringtone, um, was closed. So we are at um, Decibel mm -hmm. and eating edamame dumplings right now. And then... We got hamachi too, but it's pretty fun. Yeah, I, I'm kind of scared of that sushi and I'm like just starting to like sushi so I don't want to ruin it. But um, what else did we get? Fries? Guys, I got fried chicken. Um, here it comes. Thank you. Thank you. Fries and then her fried chicken. Okay, so I just got the Japanese pancake and she got the rice curry. <laughs> but um, that's all. That's my what I eat in a day or three. Thanks for watching. <laughs> Love you guys.